Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. As the heart of smart electronic products and a vital role in the technological competition, semiconductor chips play a vital role worldwide. The United States has long led the technology and market of the chip industry, known as the U.S. chip hegemony. However, with the ever-changing world scientific and technological landscape and the increasingly complex external environment, this dominant position has been hit unprecedentedly. Recently, Russia has developed a Chinese lithography machine, NVIDIA's popularity in China has declined, and SMIC has also begun to emerge. These three pieces of news all imply that the dominant position of U.S. chip has begun to shake. Russian Independent Lithography Machine, an icebreaker that breaks through the technological blockade. In terms of science and technology, technological blockades and sanctions against it have become a strategy often used by countries. After the United States imposed a series of technological blockades on Russia, Russia began its own lithography process research. Lithography technology is the heart of semiconductor production, and its precision and stability have a vital impact on the quality and function of the entire integrated circuit. After experiencing the technological blockade, Russia quickly made corresponding adjustments and invested heavily in lithography machines and received obvious results. It is reported that Russia has developed lithography equipment that can guarantee 350 nanometers chips, and it is expected to be able to mass produce 130 nanometers lithography machines by 2026. This achievement not only breaks the U.S. monopoly on its technology, but also lays a good foundation for Russia to achieve independent development of the semiconductor industry. Second, NVIDIA's indifference to artificial intelligence chips is a warning that its marketing strategy has failed. NVIDIA is the world's largest semiconductor company and its products are mainly concentrated in two aspects, GPU and AI. However, the sales of NVIDIA's H20 series of artificial intelligence chips listed in the mainland recently are not ideal, which is very embarrassing. Such a stock market decline is by no means a coincidence. It reflects NVIDIA's wrong marketing strategy. First, when NVIDIA was developing the H20 series, it overemphasized its technological progress and ignored the actual needs of the country. Secondly, NVIDIA did not take into account the domestic market demand in its domestic pricing method, which made the company's products sold at a high price in the country and were not recognized by consumers. In addition, due to the lack of marketing and channels, NVIDIA was unable to form a solid collaboration with its partners in the mainland, which affected the company's development. This stock market crash has severely damaged NVIDIA, but it has also given a wake-up call for the company's development. The Rise of Chinese Chips – A New Dawn for China's Chip Industry Compared with NVIDIA's poor performance in the mainland, Chinese company SMIC has achieved good results in the industry. SMIC is a leading company in China's semiconductor industry. In the past few years, it has performed quite well in technology development, market expansion, and capacity construction. According to recent performance, 
SMIC's revenue in the first quarter of this year increased by 19.7% year-on-year, and for the first time surpassed Geely Silicon in the United States to become the world's third-largest semiconductor company. Such performance not only reflects SMIC's strong strength in the global chip industry, but also shows the prosperity of China's semiconductor industry. The rapid development of SMIC technology is inseparable from its continuous investment in technology. In recent years, SMIC has continuously strengthened its research and development of high-end process technology to improve its quality and quality. At the same time, SMIC is also constantly expanding its business scope and forming close strategic alliances with a large number of well-known companies at home and abroad to jointly promote the development of the entire industry. At the same time, SMIC also attaches great importance to the establishment of production capacity, responding to market needs through continuous expansion and efficient production capacity. 4. The shaking of the core status of the United States, the transfer of the world semiconductor industry. It can be said that the decline of the United States status in the world is an important reason for the transfer of the semiconductor industry in the world. The downturn of Russian and Chinese lithography machines, NVIDIA's AI chips, and the rise of SMIC all indicate that the dominant position of the United States is shaking. This development trend not only reflects the great changes that are taking place in the semiconductor industry pattern worldwide, but also points out a new development direction for future technological competition. Due to the increase in investment in various countries around the world and the improvement of scientific and technological levels, the semiconductor industry around the world will see more diversified competition. This is both a new opportunity and a huge challenge for China's semiconductor industry. We must increase our efforts in scientific and technological research and development and continuously improve the quality and performance of our products. On this basis, we must increase cooperation and communication with foreign countries and expand foreign sales channels. Only in this way can we promote the sustainable development of China's semiconductor industry.